Masaya mag-aral ng Sensa with Easy, Win, and Ben. Your sign, Kada. Hello, masyayahing people. I'm Wayne. Do you know what lemon, orange, and vinegar have in common? They are all acids. How about baking soda, soap, and detergent? Yes, they are all bases. Acid and base are chemical characteristics of many substances that we use every day. And these are their properties. And lastly, let me show you one distinct property using this litmus paper. All acids, from blue litmus paper to red, and red litmus paper to blue if it is a base. But then, what does it actually mean for something to become acidic or basic? Well, that happens when the hydro moves, and the hydro moves are out of balance. In water, a small number of the molecules dissociate. Some of the water molecules lost a hydrogen and become hydroxyl ions. The lost hydrogen ions join up with water molecules to form hydronium ions. In short, in acids, there are more hydrogen ions than hydroxide ions in the solution. And alkaline or base when solution with more hydroxide ions than hydrogen ions. When there is an equal number of hydrogen ions and hydroxide ions, it's neutral. Hmm. How can we measure the acidity and alkalinity of a substance? Easy, and that's me. Acidity and alkalinity are measured with an algorithmic scale called pH or potential of hydrogen. And the pH scale measures how acidic or basic a substance is. The pH scale ranges from 0 to 14. A pH of 7 is neutral. A pH less than 7 is acidic. A pH greater than 7 is basic. Are you familiar with this post circulating in social media? Let's see if some of the listed samples has the same pH as they claim using this pH indicators. Now, let's see and compare the results. Ayun! Ayun! Fake news!